Cruise by Mandy here on board Celebrity Edge. Just a really quick glimpse of what an elevator area can look like. There's a lot of times I can talk to clients and they're like, oh no, that room is way too close to the elevators. Usually on many of these newer ships, as I try to point out in deck plans, the elevators may be in an interior hallway like you see here with the stairs at the far back. And then a hallway leading to state rooms on either side. So there are six elevators right here state rooms um, that door accesses if they need to do any maintenance on the toilets for the for a room potentially or um, different maintenance supplies but my stateroom door is literally right there in that group of two doors and you can see you have a motorized scooter parking out here as well so take a look how far that is standing here six elevators deck of stairs right in front of us. There's only two elevator banks on the sixth floor. So you look how far that is. I literally just stepped off that elevator right there. It's probably three steps that way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Bam, I'm at my door, 10 steps. And we really do not hear any elevator noise whatsoever. Now, where did I just come from? Right there. So when you're looking at a deck plan and you're concerned that elevator noise nearby your room might be too much, think again, because it's really not. I have not even heard the people next door to us in this panoramic ocean view room. We do have the uh, beautiful Norwegian Bliss right outside the window for the panoramic windows but very, very sound insulated and no issues whatsoever. Uh, usually you also have in between your door and your sleeping area is your restroom area. So that is an entirely more of a buffer that you have between your bed at the far end of the room and then the door to enter your room across the hall and the elevators. Now, of course, right here, you're looking at the back side of the elevators going down this hallway. There are no noise issues. So as we are always looking at different decks and deck plans and choosing location of room, um, over 300 nights on board ships myself, I would never place a client I wouldn't place myself. So I look for certain things that are good. And if I do place somebody near an elevator, I know that it's really not it's a bad location. So just a quick glimpse looking up and down the hallways here. Again, you would have the restrooms. Usually all the restrooms are located right by the stateroom doors of the stateroom. Um, so that if there is an issue, such as a clogged toilet, they're able to access your clogged toilet right outside your stateroom with an accessible door there and not have to bother you by coming into your stateroom since they work on a uh, vacuum system. So just a real quick peek of how stateroom location can still be okay and you can still enjoy your stateroom and not have any issues with noise. Cruise by Mandy signing back off to head back up stairs to check out some more items here on Celebrity Edge.